for a minute. Okay, so this is Sharon's second lamb now, and she wasn't straining or pushing. So we've just put, I've washed my hands, obviously with disinfectant. Can I go to your baby, sweetie? You can lick it while I do this. There you are. And um, this lamb's backwards as well, and it's bigger. So we would definitely need to help with that. So I've just got both back legs. I'm just pulling them through and you can see just by the size of the feet it's alive it's kicking oh, and it's just pulled its foot out of my grasp i just want to get a really good grip i just want to give her a bit of a i'm just giving her a stretch because it was quite tight getting that last lamb out and uh, this one is definitely bigger we've given her some medicine to help her dilate as well right so i'm going to pull this one out now Right, just gonna slide my hands in. Okay. God. Okay. There we are. And this one wasn't distressed at all. But we need to give a bit of a swing to get it breathing. Pretty little one. There we are. There you are. Good. I do like to see them do lots of sneezes, especially when they've come backwards. Come on. Good. And this one, tickle, tickle. Good. They find it a bit easier to breathe if their legs are, well, actually the easiest way is if their legs are out like that and their front legs are tucked under. Rub the body, that helps to stimulate the lungs as well. Good. Oh, that's okay. There you are, another sneeze. Another sneeze, come on. Lovely. 